here's a look at what our site looks like. As you can see, there's not a whole lot of space, but it's not terrible. We have seen closer. This couple right here, very nice. We've been hanging out with them. I mean, that's what you have to do when you're this close. Been raining here, so we have um, on and out and everything's kind of piled up under there. But everything is gravel. Hi, friends. The water is shared between this camper and us but they're good with water they have water on board uh, so in that case if you ever run into that it's always good to have a splitter so you can split the water between the two campers or if you just need to get water you can do that without bothering anybody or without cutting anything off uh, do have a picnic table and we're really, it's probably not as close as it looks, but we're close to this big old oak tree back here. And our power is on this side. So that gives you a good look at what our site looks like. Since there are no, uh, I guess you would say, water utilities at the camp at your campsite, they do have two dump sites, dump station. This is dump station number two, and we uh, have men's and women's bathrooms here with showers and on the other side there's a newer one and the cool thing is this uh, uh, I guess you would call it a I don't know what you would call it but it's like a meeting center nah don't call it a meeting center we'll check it out have a nice outdoor pavilion that you can come and uh, hang out in Sunday school 10 a.m. April through October everyone's welcome and it's got a nice fireplace. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yep, this is a site. Got the water right there. Big old fire pit. Table. Now this is a county run park. And this is section B for smaller campers and tents I'm sure um, they got a whole setup right there so this is one part of it it's, it's, um, I would say it is a fairly old campground but they taking good care of it it looks like the power poles look to be fairly new water is definitely new Hey, buddy. Big old German Shepherd. Protecting his territory, I guess. And scaring me. And sca and scaring, scaring me. Hi. How you doing? Hi. And then we're up the hill in C. He gave us a room. <laughs> <laughs> so what's that? Okay. I don't know. Wanna walk through there? Yeah.
like a kid's playground over there on that side as we come up the hill and like I said this is a county park so it's not going to have some of the amenities of some other parks that we've been to but the price is definitely right $25 a night this is a big site that's B6 another one right beside it mm -hmm. bath house over here the kids area right there campers and worshipers by the lazy J camping club the lazy J and there we are over there let me zoom in a little bit Okay, now, there we go. Oh, there's a bus. Yeah, schoolies over there. <coughs> now, over on this section, which is also C, is where some of the bigger RVs are. And they, they're, everybody's got the same. Nobody has sewer it's just water and electric and the water you have to share so you had to have either a way of sharing it with a splitter or put water in your tank and use it that way these are some good size sites here and then here's the old schoolie old school bus with a guard dog inside And it looks like a dog park behind that with some tents. So that's probably a group camping thing back there. Mm -hmm. Group camping area. I thought these would be nice. Mm -hmm. C34, C33, yeah, that one. So, a ah. so it is a whole area back here. Mm -hmm. Maybe this is where the night folks are. Yeah, probably is. Mm -hmm. The tents all back in the woods. Mm -hmm. Y'all check this out. Huh, somebody stepped on it, but it's bunch of little mushrooms but the real reason I came over here is it's got tents back here tent city so that's a tent spot and then over there is a tent spot and kind of scattered all throughout their little tent spots Hi guys, this is Belinda from All About Banks, and we have met <laughs> Victoria. Victoria, and Victoria has a special job that we all are appreciative for. She is a travel nurse. Now, as a travel nurse, optimum word being travel. Well, she has found the perfect thing <laughs> for her as far as travel is concerned. She has bought what is called a Scotty. Which is how long is it? Uh, ten feet. It is <laughs> ten feet long. And this is her home. This is her travel home. And she pulls it with a Santa, Santa Fe. Fe. And uh, as she travels, she'll find her another campsite, <laughs> park it, and go to work. I mean, how easy is that? Now we're gonna walk in to the door. Because this is her private spot, so we're not going to open anything. But we just want to show you how cute this is. Check out this cuteness. Look at the light fixtures. And the pretty little curtains. I mean, really, it's all you need. It's pretty awesome. <laughs> it is. It is. 
is. This is Victoria's guard dog. <laughs> Theo. Theo holds down the camper while Victoria's at work. Make sure when mama comes home, everything is in tip top shape. He's like, I know you're talking about me. <laughs> <laughs> this is so cool. So cute. A couple owned it. They bought it in 2016. And when they bought it, the back the windows were all crooked and everything. So um, the, on the back they have a corn husk and they called it husky. <laughs> and then they got to um, Ohio and then they were so lucky that they got in Ohio. So they got the green leaf clover back there. So they called it the lucky, lucky husk. <laughs> um, so they did, redid all the siding, um, the axles, the wheels, like everything is brand new in here. Um, they added a vent and like all the electric. Mm -hmm. oh. Look at what the bumper is. Yeah. Their uh, nephew loves kayaking, so they put the kayak back with the kayak back. Oh, cute. <laughs> oh, yeah. It's pretty awesome. Uh, and then they just got the... Awesome. I know you do. And dice and as valve stem, <laughs> stem covers. <laughs> <laughs>